Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy 16. So, in the last one we did a bunch of side quests, and uh, at the very beginning we also went to the orchestrian role and for main story and found the piece that Mid needs to uh, finish the ship. So, uh, yeah, we basically did that and nothing else. Just side quests, hunts, you know, everything. But that is all done now. So we are ready to move on, and we're going to immediately, apparently going into a dungeon of some sort. I'm guessing we're going to take the ship right now, I would assume, and probably take it through this canal. And But if it's a dungeon, are we going to fight on the ship? I know I keep calling them dungeons, but it, it's basically a dungeon, right? So uh, uh, one more thing I want to note that I screwed up in my <laughs> discussion yesterday. I kept calling this the wrong thing. I finally corrected it. It's Black Wolf Stocks again. Why do I keep screwing that up? I was so hot and tired. I, I just, I kept screwing it up. I was like, I knew the name of the song, but I kept saying another song. And in editing, I also got it wrong. And I was just like, ugh. What, what song am I trying to talk about here? But, you know, whatever. I just wanted to correct that so Sokin doesn't, you know, hate me. <laughs> for... For, for incorrectly naming a song or something. Um, so I think we're all good to go. I'm going to assume it's going to be little enemies, not just a big enemy. I'm going to put on Flare Breath. If I'm wrong, uh, maybe maybe we'll have time to change it. Who knows? Uh, okay. Let's go. It's a little bit colder in here today, thankfully. Also, my chair broke. Either chair. Just a random, unimportant, you know, fact. Uh, if I'm blocking extra, it's because I have a wider chair. I hope I'm not. Nope. Go back that way. We're good. <laughs> Are we going to save Jill? I really hope we do. I was right, Clive. My dad had it all worked out. He'd be proud of you, Mid. His writings may have helped, but this achievement is all yours. True. <laughs> Can we catch them? The Inayar is one of the largest, fastest vessels ever built. And it won't help she has the wind at her back. Any other ship would be hard pressed to keep pace with her, let alone reel her in. Oh. But this isn't any other ship. This is the Enterprise! And the world's never seen anything like my dad's engine. It certainly hasn't. Captain Mid. Clive, what do you know of Barnabas Tharn? Nothing. Only what the bards sing. And he sailed to Ash from southern lands. That it was his mastery of the blade which won him the throne. And that his sword, Odin's sword, can sever the very threads of creation. But don't lose any sleep over a last tilt. We'll do what we must to survive. What we must. The light! I thought this cove was meant to be hidden! Uh oh. Uh. Mid! Company! Hey? We'll hold them off until the ship is ready! But hurry! Bullets! All hands! Man your stations! Well, this isn't expecting, or how I was expecting to fight. with me what a team oh this is the Akashic <laughs> here they come 
Damn, that's a lot of them. Uh huh. Oh. I'm sorry. How are we doing, mid? I thought you said that ship was fast. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm cutting off so much dialogue. I'm doing I'm doing too much damage and cutting off like all the dialogue. <laughs> Here, let's uh Oh Hey! Hey, we got a stagger bar. A little dark in the scope. Uh, we'll throw some stuff on you. Five, six, seven, eight, five. Is the double? Oh. I'll do two. Alright, swing! There we go. Oh, he's dead. <clears throat> yeah, I've got a swing in there at least. I'm sorry. I'm. What am I? Forty-one. I. I really hope I. The story catches up to my level soon. <laughs> I'm still going to do all the side quests regardless. That was easy enough. All right, you lousy lot. Get your asses on board. She's ready to sail. You heard the captain. <laughs> Clive. Ah. But, but I thought he was... Confounded. Then it is as I feared. Sleipnir is no man, but a creation of Odin. And eternal. But... Phoenix's fiery fundament! Have you no normal enemies? I guess not. That... I know he could create multiple. What? Round. Of course we are. Right, Lord Rosfield? My boy, there was a time people called me the Executioner. Or was it my ex? No matter, <laughs> heads will roll all the same. Mate, new plan! You leave, we follow! Follow? Swimming, are you? Oh, fuck at me! Way anchor! Uh, do we... Do we have, that's a lot of harbors. Engine dead slow ahead! Oh, boy. Have care, my friends. Tis Oops, not uh... that runs through in Odin's veins. These foes will not fall easily. Are you sure? Like oaks before a woodman's axe. Good thing I brought one! Kind of confused how they uh, fell that easily. Keep this up? As long as it takes. Unless you have a best friend. Well, I've already killed at least five of the bastards. <laughs> oh, fuck it. Let's do the lot. Yeah. They're not nearly as tanky as the one harbor we fought earlier, so that's a little weird. 
Why are these ones so much weaker? Oh, they still got the same moves though. I, uh, there we go. That's. Get that guy in. Oh. Should we make for the ship? Not yet. Wait for my signal. Right after this Giga Flare. <laughs> oh my god, even more. I think I'll ever get tired of this song. In your own oh. time, Clive. Right, grab for it. Oh, nice. Run! Oh, that's a big jump for him. Grab him. Uh-oh. Can they not swim? Enterprise escaped? Don't tell me that was the uh, dungeon, or I guess try. Uh, I guess it could be. Like, honestly, who, who says they all have to be long things? All right, well, okay. Now, mate! All right, engines go ahead! And hold on tight! Maybe I should just call them instances. Look at that. The Naldia Nero. Oh, the Einhayar. What do you want? That's quite a mess you've made. And wholly unnecessary. <sighs> you are my offering to Muthos. I would not see you damaged. I see. He called it an offering, not like a trap. I mean, overall, it still is kind of like a blackmail trap. Now back to your stations! Every bell spent treading water puts another league between us and the galleon. I don't suppose Mid has a spare engine. <laughs> Since you rose from the grave, my fortunes have plummeted. Are you absolutely certain of this quest of yours, Clive? The foes you face are as terrible as they are numerous. Aye, and they'd have us live and die on their terms, which should answer your question. <laughs> You have that same stubborn look as your father did when he set his mind to something. On the battlefield, I am but a single axe. A deadly one, mind, but a single one nonetheless. 
Yet what you require is a thousand, and I believe my old friend in Brandala can provide them. Uh. What? Take care, Clive. I have many more tales of your father's exploits to share. And I cannot very well do that if you're dead. Again. Good luck, Uncle. And may fair winds attend you. As for you, Joshua, take care. I shall do my best, Uncle. Aww. Farewell, my nephews. Don't next you... you see me, it shall be with an army at my back. I really <laughs> hope so. Oh. oh. <laughs> that would be an amazing way to come back. Cheerio. So don't die before then. Please. Byron Byron is t too pure. Oh <sighs> yeah. Do keep up, my boy. I would hate to try to row that. Well, we can't have him showing us up now, can we? We would never hear the end of it. Oh? There he is. What are you doing? Have you lost it? Greek of mercy. I would say it's Bahamut's fault more than his himself. He didn't want this. What have I done? Oh! My lord! Medicine girl again. I swear, she's secretly the protagonist. She shows up everywhere. Ah, okay. Yeah. So the last thing was just a, like an instance, basically. Full steam! Blessed with mild currents and warm waters, the narrow allows for swift travel to the Dominion Oriflame and stone here, without having to circle through the dangerous outer sea. Kinda wish we could. Also, if there were any time to reveal a water dominant, it would be right now. Is there going to be a water dominant? Or does that just not exist? I mean, it's fine if it doesn't. I, I, I get it. Maybe they just were never born. But, like, you could totally throw a Leviathan or Bismarck in here. If it was ever going to happen, it'd be now. Otherwise, it's never going to happen. between here and Walud, but any ship heading north has to round Zemeckis and put through the narrow. Maintain our current bearing north-northeast, and we'll catch the Black Galleon before she vanishes again. What's to prevent her from circling around Ash from the south? With these winds in those waters, it'd take forever and a fortnight to reach Stone here. Hmm. Mid knows what she's talking about, Clive. Better than any of us lot, anyway. I say we do as she tells... Sails on the horizon. She's ours. Ooh. Look alive, boys! Full ahead! And keep those furnaces fed! Aye, aye. Do you feel that, Jill? All hands! Battle stations!
Let's see what this girl can do. I mean... He's not really trying to get away, though. Oh, he's in armor. Where one leads, so does the other follow. The bond of consciousness which joins them condemning both to the same fate. Yet my every attempt to strike it from their hearts serves only to tighten its hold. Oh. But then there is naught my blade cannot sever. Is that like his semi prime? Uh oh. You better you better turn. Great Grigos gas! Jesus. One of us. Out of port! Heads down, you brutes! And race for impact! Dude, Mid, Mid is such a badass now. Oh, you meant literally. It's now or never. I'll find her. No, no one died. How? But Odin's on the boat with us. This is not good. Wait. Oh, I, I want to know what's going on. I'm I'm so scared for them. Doesn't matter. There's so many people who can die here. Oh my god. Okay. Ooh. Got some pirate pirate music going on. Oh, hi. Wait, this sounds familiar. Okay, they're not gonna get to attack. Get in here! Oh, I forgot I <laughs> ravage. Um. Ninja. Nice try. Starting with fire, huh? Grab. Five, six. Can I go back into it? Oh. Damn it, attack me. I'm just waiting for one. Oh, that one came out of nowhere. There we go. 
And he's dead. Um, but we know she's inside. Aha. What the? Can anyone see anything? I need to hurry. Brightness is nine, by the way. Nine out of ten. Oh no. This is a shitty position to be in. Here? Alright, that's it. No, 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 I gotta hit one of you to chain react. Were you a healer? Yeah, you're a healer. Alright, I think I got him. You next. Nope, uh, come here. I kind of wish this ability was shorter. <laughs> it's, it goes for so long, it's kind of broken. <laughs> alright, alright. This is fine. I think that guy might have a stagger bar, though. This guy. Damn. Oh, yeah. This one. Wake and wake him! Come here. I'm just going to wind up. Three, four, five, six is probably good. I hate that move. I don't even know if I want to waste anything big on him. Yeah, I'm just gonna flare breath him. Actually, no! Okay. I thought I changed targets. There we go. Ow. Come back. I really need like a better way to handle it when there's only like two to three enemies. Boop. <laughs> she must be here somewhere. Uh, di didn't we come from there? I think that may be where we have to go. I do have to check over here, though. There's clearly something over here. No, we came from that one. I don't think it matters where we come out. Oh, 
Oh, Steel Silk, I couldn't have lived without that. Definitely not. All right, did I go backwards? I did, so it is the other one. Maybe. I don't see any other doors. Okay, this is new. This is new. I. Hold on, let me let me let me just double check here. Maybe my TV just has a glare, but I can't see anything. It looks the same. <laughs> oh well, I'll, I'll I'll keep it. I'll keep it on eight. I think YouTube might be a little brighter. It's just that this monitor specifically is too too dark for me. Ooh, Earthen Fury. Uh, I'm guessing that's 12 seconds. 13.5 seconds? Okay, that's... That's pretty helpful. Who are these random people on this ship? Oh, nice. Um... Yeah, get, get in this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn. There we go. Come on in. Such a weird angle for flareback too. Oh, okay, this ship is definitely leaking. Jill, oh. you came. Get back. I'll explain later. Hands. Can you walk? Out of here, I can. What? What's the trap then? Stand still. Phoenix. Are you not the dominant of fire? I see naught before me but a guttering flame. What? Oh no. We're not really fighting over the sea, are we? In honest then. Ah! Oh damn. We Wait, did you actually block it? Oh my god, he diverted it. <laughs> oh no! That is so cool. It stayed split? I thought we would have got out of there, but no, I, I guess not. Can you go on? Oh, 
think so. Did he, like, leave her broken? <sighs> like, I'm wondering if he fully healed or... Because he has the ability to, like, straight up kill her and he didn't. But to where? Here's the theme again. You. What did you do to Joshua? The Phoenix? Oh, I expect he will survive. This consciousness in which you coil your feeble souls is grown thick with desperation. And thus has my master turned to my blade. The world will soon be painted in black. And all that live shall gather in death's autumn wake. Not if we remove the cause of this misery. Not if we destroy the last of the Mother Crystals and restore balance to the world. I don't know if that'll do it. Come. Do you truly think it's so simple? The blight is inevitable. Not even the Almighty might stop its endless march. Your efforts will avail us naught. Naught, that is. But suffering. Huh. You must embrace the truth, Mythos. Accept your place with the Lord. Keep it. As long as there's a chance, there's a choice. Ever led astray by your blind resolve. That's got to be a semi prime. Now, it is time you learn the inevitability of your divine fate. However much it may hurt. Get as far away as you can. Clive, no! Trust me, Jill. <sighs> are we... Are we actually fighting Odin right now? I thought this would be way later. What? Um... Oh, but we do. If only to remind you of your duty. Oh my god, that stagger bar. What? <laughs> He's Virgil. He's just Virgil. That was literally one of Virgil's moves. You have grown much. It has a special. I fear my lord will still find you lacking. I don't know if I can get nine. Yeah, I missed him. Too slow. Whoa! Ah! I thought I was going to parry that. Fire and fury, and for what? <laughs> Stopping the blight. A foolish notion fed to you by a foolish man. Oh! How dare you? You know naught of this world, nor what? of our place in it. If our fates were so easily rewritten, oh my God. we would all be gods. <laughs> Excuse me while I just... I gotta get it on cooldown. I have seen oh. If reason cannot sway you. Um, what? What? I need I need to deal. What? 
five? Oh my god. No, no, no. This is impossible. Until you've been given. And thus is the light of hope severed. That was meant to happen, I'm assuming. That seemed you impossible. Would yield so soon. Never. Life. Oh, what the? She's supposed to run. Do you not see? Your iron will weighs you down, dragging you ever further from your purpose. And what is my purpose? Mythos. Who are we? What are the dominance? The breath of the Creator still warm on our lips. We carry his light that we might guide the masses in his name. We are but mighty acts of God. We are more than that. You would be nothing without what he has granted you. Ooh. The power we wield is his. And yet every time we draw upon it, it wears away at our very being. It breaks us. It unmakes us. That its immaculate aspect might reveal itself. The Icon. It is too much for even his chosen few. Apart from you, Mythos. You wield the might of many, yet your body does not answer for its avarice. What are you saying? What I am saying? is that we dominance are a means to an end. We were created uh. for you, that you might drink deep of our strength and thereby fulfill your divine purpose. Which is? To feed. As you would know, could you only look beyond the walls of your prison of self-regard. As long as you choose to ignore this, you shall never penetrate my defenses. Still, you may take solace in the fact that you are not alone in your plight. The chains of volition shackle all of mankind, but there is yet cause to rejoice. For the Lord in his mercy has taken pity on his flawed creations shall see them restored to their proper forms. And what exactly would that be? Why, loyal servants to God? No. Manners, Lord Rossfield? They are men, like you and me. Albeit ones unburdened by the wills that drive our kind to madness. They are pure. They are divine. You mean to turn everyone Akashic? Not turn, Mythos. Turn back. Oh? For too long has mankind been led astray by their clamorous wills. It is time they return to a world of quiet equality, where they might once more know salvation. Salvation? And abandon everything we hold dear! We don't need your salvation. We'll save ourselves, and we'll do it on our own terms. Not yours, and not your gods! With every defiant expression of your will, the tighter the chains of consciousness become. But perhaps that fact may be put to use. He's kind of going in circles. <laughs> Clive! Are they coming down? 
The faster it binds you to the remaining dominance, the stronger your hunger will become. Until it leads you back to the only answer there ever was. Mayhap not by the path my master intended, but back all the same. Uh-oh. Ash is not far. I could freeze a path. You're in no fit state. Probably not, but I can try. No. Oh, you're making a tunnel. Don't look back. Wait, what? Did you just give me victory music for Clive getting bested? That this did not feel like a victory. Uh oh okay, okay. Impulse damage up. That that's got potential. That might be useful. We'll we'll talk about that later. I am so curious about this whole situation. The shadow oh we're on ash. Or the camera's on Ash. I don't know if we made it. Did we? I hope the others are safe. The Enterprise was clear of the gap when we fell. They made it, Jill. And they would have seen the ice where it led. Oh. We need only wait till dawn. <laughs> Excuse me? This is the second time Barnabas has bested me. Powerless against him. And maybe there really is nothing else for it but to give yourself to his master. Only you won't do that. The Clive I know would never do that. So you believe. What Barnabas said was true, then. I'm more monster than man. And each time I summon the flames from within, I burn away the things that make me who I am. Do you, though? Think of what you've used that power for. Of all the people you've saved. It doesn't matter how or by whom it was granted, only how you choose to use it. And you've chosen to use it for good, haven't you? I've also used it to kill. What if that's my purpose? What if it's all I'm good for? Still that same boy I grew up with. Always so eager to save everyone around you, and yet always so alone. Mm. Because you failed to realize the one thing that needed saving most of all. You, Clive. You. You never once took the time to save yourself. Myself? I think I might be beyond saving. No one is beyond saving, provided they want to be saved. You fight to survive. And you survive so that you may protect those you love. It's what you do. What you've always done. <laughs> and 
I know you're not about to change. So I'm going to help you. To give you what you need to protect us all. No. Literally, my predictions, right? If, if this is what you want, then... Don't worry, Clive. It is. No. Oh. We know this doesn't kill them, so... This burden... I'll give you the strength to bear it alone. Allowed to show this on YouTube? I don't know. <laughs> Convenient camera angles might be saving me here. Uh, I'm more surprised that I'm right than I am about this happening, I'll be honest. The time, Clive. Oh. I promise you, Jill. We will find a way to escape this fate. Dad. Find a way to save each other. Oh. I swear to God. I promise you, Clive, that I will be there no matter what you must become. I know. I never thought a smile could bring me so much joy. Finally! Took you guys long enough. Uh, I, I thought they were trying to bait that whole time. They're like, oh, and then awkward, nope. Uh, at the very, very end. That, that's very much something they would do, but... That took... Hold on. If another scene starts... Okay, right before that. All right, all right. Let, let me let me let me just check this. What does it say on my actual game? Ninety-one hours. Ninety-one hours for them to finally seal that deal. Okay, a lot of that might be AFK time and me going into the Aretta Stone between episodes, but. <laughs> oh. All right, I am much more hopeful for her survival now after that scene. 
Although I apologize for my probably loud yelling over some of the lines. I, I was just... Been waiting so long for that. What of Barnabas? Do we pursue him? No. Our paths will cross again soon enough. Whether we like it or not. We got Besides, side quest to do. <laughs> there is something we must do first. I swear to God. Of course. Drake's spine. The last mother crystal. Isn't that where he is, though? The Einherjer is at the bottom of the sea. Walud won't dare move on storm without her. But they know we're coming now. We'll need a plan. And a damn good one at that. Then let's go home and find one. Oh. Ash will have to wait. This would be a perfect thumbnail. That too. Anything with Torgal in it would be a perfect thumbnail. Unfortunately. Not gonna happen. Honestly, that felt like an Act 3 entrance right there. Just, it's, well, maybe like an Act 4, honestly. Because, like, Act 3 really felt like when the red sky or the dark sky happened. But this, that felt like a, a big change in uh, thought, I guess. All right, for, for anyone who is watching and is like, why was why weren't you surprised there? You, you just, you didn't barely react it. I mean, look at my prediction right there. Save Jill, but then she'll be forced to give us her power somehow. Forced is not exactly the word I, I should have chosen there. I just predicted that instead of her dying, we would take her powers and make her, you know, normal, <laughs> I guess. So, yeah, I I kind of expected that to happen. It was either that or she died, and then we took her power. But Because I thought maybe, like, she'd get all yellow-eyed and go Shiva on us. And, and the, the cool thing about this is we have her powers now, but she could still go Shiva. Like... I don't know if she would be able to go Shiva with blue eyes, though, because she, the only people we've seen turn after losing their powers, lost control. Okay, maybe that wouldn't be cool, but it, but if she could retain control, then it would be cool. Uh, let me hide that again. There we go. All right, back to the hideaway. This is not, this is not what I expected coming here. I didn't think we'd fight Barnabas. I didn't think he'd kick our ass that hard. <laughs> Mid says Odin split the sea in two. Yep. She's always been partial to a tall tale. Nope. But there's tall, and then there's tall. I struggle to believe it myself. I see your uncle isn't with you. He stayed with the Enterprise. After our brush with the Einherjah, she was in urgent need of repair. And my uncle knows a shipwright in Randalar. We're to join him there when we're ready to sail for Ash. You sure that's wise? Last I heard, the place was still overrun with a Kashyyyk. That's fine. Show me a city where that isn't true. Ultima's plague is spreading. We're running out of time, aren't we? We've done our best to shore up the hideaway. But I doubt a few planks will stop what's coming. Still, we'll keep at it. Every little helps, I suppose. Let's hope so. All right, I'm... Get ready. Across the narrow. Get ready for me to look at this map. Ah. Ho hold that thought. <clears throat> Attuning with Shiva not only changes the element of his magic, allows several new abilities such as Ice Age, which forcefully knocks back enemies great distances. Uh, Shiva sounds like it might go good with Ramu then. Knock him back and then boop. Uh, long range stuff. Iconic feats cold snap can be used to swiftly move left, right, back, and forward to either dodge attacks or close in on the enemy. Alright, I didn't even look at this. Forward. 
Wait, it has no cooldown? Huh. The thing it leaves behind, though, I wonder if that causes enemies to be slowed or something. I should visit Joshua. Assuming Tony will allow it. Hold up. Shiva channeled. Well, that confirms it. We're not getting a water dominant. I mean, it should have confirmed it by now already, but <laughs> this is obviously Odin. There's no way this isn't Odin. So, I thought Odin was next. I thought we'd get Shiva last, if anything. I also thought there was a chance maybe a Leviathan would be revealed and we'd get Leviathan, but... I'm totally down for ice moves. Attacking with L while sliding can temporarily freeze enemies. Huh. Can be used to dodge incoming attacks. Uh, while well, sliding... O can be used while sliding to perform a follow-up attack called Frostbite. But you're using O to use it in the first place. So I have to hit O while sliding to... I'll, I'll try it out. Preci precisely dodging in an enemy attack cold snap with Cold Snap freezes all enemies within radius. Permafrost. Duration is determined by the strength of the attack dodge. Oh, <laughs> Interesting. Um. Wow, 3,000? Alright, just for reference. That costs 375 to master. This is 3,000. To increase duration. Hmm. Mesmerize. I'm just looking at it first. Okay. Oh, launch multiple shards of ice that... Upon striking lighter enemies, draw them into Clive. What about big enemies? What does it do to them? Can be used mid-air. While well, used in mid-air, enemies are pulled directly beneath Clive for an upheaval? Yeah, yeah, upheaval. Also fires three shards behind Clive when upgraded. Really? Interesting. This one might be okay. All right, unleash a glacier before Clive that deals damage to and knocks back any enemies in the path. Holding the execute button increases the attack width and knockback force. Ah, increasing in the red zone. Okay, so it's Titan. I see. Increases width and knockback while adding a freezing effect. Oh. And this upgrading it just increases precision window, which isn't a big deal. Alright, Rhyme? Summon a colossal ice crystal that deals continued as damage to all enemies that become trapped inside. Wow, that looks... And he can move it? Kind of looked like he, he moved it. Did he move it? Will not disturb enemies immediately in front of Clive, so I can throw it behind enemies. Hmm. If an enemy comes in contact with the crystal, it'll be drawn in and continues suffering continuous damage. Crystal can only draw in smaller, lighter enemies. What does it do to big enemies, then? Press the button again. It'll cause it to dissipate and be replaced by another. Interesting. I might switch up my build simply to see these new abilities, because seeing the same thing over and over would suck. All right, let's see what it looks like first. Diamond Dust. Freeze everything? Okay. That's decent. That's that's a massive stun right there. Summon a winter storm that freezes enemies in place with a radi within a radius before dealing massive ice damage and knocking them back. Increase ice blast to two. Increase hits for each blast. Wow. There's a lot to take in here. Honestly, I would get rid of Ramu, keep Judgment Bolt, and test some Shiva moves. I think that's what I'm going to do. Alright, I'm going to regret this. Uh, just, it, it's fine. I can swap abilities anytime I want. I can't change the Garuda thing. It's always going to be Gouge, Raging Fist. It's too good for me, personally. I, I, that one has to stay. 
Shiva, I have, I put upheaval on and mesmerize for now. I want to try jumping in the air uh, and then using mesmerize to pull everything under me. And then upheaval does more damage the higher you up you are. So obviously being in the air is great there. Uh, I just don't know if this is going to work because I have to jump off of an enemy to really get any height. So it might be better to have Wicked Wheel to get up in the air uh, instead of this, but I want to try the Shiva move, so <laughs> what, what, what can you do? And then I threw Judgment Bolt on Bahamut. So Bahamut's just damage. Absolutely damage. Uh, I don't like Mesmerize's stats right now. It's, it's not very high, but that's fine. Okay. Map. Okay. Ah, we can max out how many potions we can hold now. And another blacksmith quest and more missives. Anything else? Holy shit. Goat, how bad is it? Quick look. Okay, Isabel. Martha. Lubor and Theodore. Okay. Cyril. Isn't that's the yeah, Duty Undying. That's uh someone from Yote's order. Interesting. Three, four, five, six, seven. Why are you not updated? Why is all this updated, but there's no new hunts? Seriously? Maybe they didn't expect me to do them yet? I'm going to talk to Joshua before we end. I just want to see how many quests we're going to be dealing with in the next... Maybe two episodes. It might be two side quests back to back. I'll be honest. Awfully thin. Oh, we gotta talk to the bard too. Will not forget this kindness, my lord. I shall go to his... but as soon as the Yeah, we've, we've we've already heard that. Doris. Okay, so one quest here. What what is that? Eight quests. Three, four, five, six. Seven. Yeah, no, no, we have eight quests here. God damn it. A healer's place. Thank you for helping me guide my mentor free from his mortal coil. Contrary to what the mad madding crowd believes, we visitors are not without our limits. I cannot hope to cure every ill, mend every wound, save every life. The only medicine that will see you home safe without fail is prevention. Not that this knowledge will ever stop any of you from chasing down some behemoth for its toenails. <laughs> True. I bet, I bet if we talk to Taria now, she's going to have a same thing everyone else gets when you read their missives. Oh boy. Blacksmith. Alright, what does he got? Oh, about the Enterprise. Yeah. The blighted, the blighted thing float. Did it. <laughs> the way of all that shit. Uh, Mid had me knock out. I thought it'd sink straight to the bottom, right? Always the way with Mid's inventions, though, isn't it? You ain't got a clue what the hell you're looking at when she hands you the designs. But they always seem to work. Clever girl, that one. A right boil on the arse sometimes, but clever all the same. <laughs> so, what it be? Ice Brand. When did we get an ice shard? Was it during the fight with Barnabas? That should have been my clue right there. Wow, it's only five stronger, yet deep with frostbite, leaving her fell mark upon their skins. Should last you a good while. All right, we got a new weapon. Anything else? Oh, oh, I need to see it. Oh, it doesn't have a hilt. Er, what do you call it when it sticks out? The, is that the hilt? It's just, it's just a straight. Maybe it looks different when I take it out, but I can't, I can't use it right now. Ooh. Not oh, not updated. Be seeing ya. 
Uh, Karen's not... Actually, despite it not showing up, I want to know if, like, she actually has no dialogue. Okay. Come back soon. And I mean that. The Arete Stone is... We should have got two. Yeah. The Ironworks is just a short little thing. And then Naldi on Narrow. That was so weird. It, like, it was the most unusual feeling dungeon of, of all of them that we've had so far. Like, it was very much just, like, story-driven in a way. Also, the, the songs that were playing, I could have sworn one of those was FF4. I swear. I couldn't tell you which one. It was right before you fought Barnabas. Uh, and then... I just want to say whatever song that was playing while Jill and Clive were sitting together a is, shirt. This is a tavern. it was a very good song. Okay. Uh, talk to Vivian and then we'll go do the infirmary so that the next episode is solely focused on side quests. Oh, wait. <laughs> Adrift on form flecked peace Despair looms below. I wish the music would Yet stop playing this. In the dark, a flame is sparked that warms us in its glow. Thank you, Lucan. Obviously, that one's still related. I gotta write down. All right, so that's done and added. He said eight songs already since since uh, coming to the new hideaway and Clive learning his name. <laughs> uh, I don't know why I keep adding those to the list. How are you feeling, Joshua? Better than I was. But not nearly as well as you should be. Your cuts and burns may have healed, but your body still bears the burden of every spell cast. Then what would you have had me do? It was no ordinary foe we faced. It was the Warden of Darkness. <laughs> Yet still, it was not enough. The King could have ended me at any moment, but instead chose to toy with me like a Curl does a mouse. You, you underestimate yourself. Oh, it was crystal clear. Only one man established his dominance that day, and that man was Barnabas. I'm sorry, brother. That was ill-spoken. It's just, I have never felt so powerless. And when so many are looking to us for strength, perhaps... Uh, perhaps the prince feels the same. Please, cut to the prince. Medicine girl, did you save him? Is she the new protagonist? Nameless slum. Huh. There's still potential for him to, like, go Bahamut with us. And then we have Bahamut, Phoenix, Ifrit take out Odin. That would be epic. What is this place? Don't move. <laughs> She's so tiny. Here, 
It's fresh from the well. This sounds like a new song too. Grandmother told me spirits sometimes get lost and that the lanterns guide them to their proper place. I set one on the river for her when she passed away. help knowing it's all his fault. The fiend works from the shadows. Was it you who guided my hand then, Ultima? No, not you. This is my doing, my fault, my sin to bear. And for it, I must atone. Your hurts are healing nicely. It was my poultices that saw you well. You make them. And sell them, or try to. Earns me enough for bread, most days. Forgive me. I have nothing to... I know, but I couldn't just leave you lying there. You're going then? Of course. I'm healed. Thanks to you and your poultices. Hmm. Will you promise to come back and visit? So when he said, I must atone, he's not doing what I think. He's, he needs the same acceptance that Clive needed when he realized oh, he was Ifric. It would seem that I owe you my wings. Okay. Okay, that line confirms he's, he's probably going to help us. Please. Perhaps he can find an answer. You will be returning to Walud soon, I gather. I see no reason to wait. Then neither do I. <laughs> I can think of a few. But I doubt they'll stop you. You will take your medicine. Okay. Of course, Lady Tyre. Set on leaving already, are you? How long will it take us to get back to Ash? Dunno, about the same amount of time it took us to get here. Maybe less, if your uncle can find someone trustworthy to patch up the Enterprise. All depends on where we're putting into port, mind. Yes, it's not as if we can put ashore wherever we choose. We have to assume that the whole of Ash is hostile, and that we'll be attacked on sight. Then we must find a place they won't think to look. And I have an idea who might know of one. The Professor! I'll go and tell you coming! Ah. While you're plotting our course, I'll be in the shelves with your lawsman. I wish to pick his brains about Ultima. Then I'll talk to Karen about supplies for the journey. They may not be easy to come by in Ash. Your brother's body won't take much more of this recklessness. You know that, don't you? I do. Oh, poor Taria. I still witness it all. You've seen more of the world these past five years than most do in a lifetime. It's a shame you never had a moment to enjoy it. I don't know about that. He's, he's had some 
joyous moments. Uh, mostly <laughs> because of Byron. Uh, okay, so, yeah. When they said that there's no time to wait, they were, they were just joking around, right? There's clearly time to wait, because I'm about to spend at least one episode, possibly two, on these side quests, depending on how many cutscenes there are. I don't know. Uh, it turns out she didn't have extra dialogue like I thought she would. Unless... Oh, you can't even talk to him. Uh, yeah, so... I, I think we'll end it here. I'll wait on Vivian, because, you know... That usually just, like, points out exactly where we're gonna go when... <sighs> I can't tell if this is the actual end of the game, like, coming up. Because it said... Where did it say? 84? 86%. There's still 14%. Uh, and what we just did was actually 6%, which actually did kind of fly by, surprisingly. So, potentially, this is quite close to the end of the game, honestly. Oh, boy. I, I don't like it when I know I'm close to the end, but everyone's... It's, it's got to end eventually. It, it's just... It sucks. It sucks trying to say goodbye to it. How are you? Then again... Why settle for low-born chaff when we've honest-to-goodness royalty right here beneath our roof? If Prince Dion cannot see my love for him... Oh, God damn it! ...perhaps the Phoenix will. And now she's actually going for Joshua. It's okay, she doesn't leave this little railing. It's not gonna matter. You just sit up here staring at all the men walking by. She's interesting. Okay, so... In the next episode, expect side quests. Uh, and the one after that, I don't know. If it doesn't say sidetracked, we're moving on with story. But we'll see. Who knows how long this takes. So thanks for watching. Let me know if you like it. And I will see you in the next one.